What's up guys, this is Dennis with Luke Zown Jewelry. In this video, I'm gonna be talking to you about the flat curb chain and specifically the eight millimeters. So let's go ahead and take a closer look. So I wanna say thanks to every single one of you guys that is tuning in right now watching this video. If you haven't already hit the like button, make sure you do that. It really helps me out with the algorithm. Join the algorithm way with me. And if you already hit the like button, put a wave emoji in the comments below, just letting me know you did that. I wanna thank you guys in advance and let's go ahead and move on. So guys, I wanted to make this video to give you guys a better idea on how this chain actually looks like when it comes to the eight millimeter. I know when you go to the website, all you see is a white background with a chain on it and that doesn't give you a good idea. So I did take different B-roll just to show you guys how it looks like. I did put some on on the neck. I tucked it in and I also tucked them out. I have two chains I'm wearing on the neck and so I really hope this video helps you guys. All right guys, like always, I like to mention that this chain is manufactured in Italy. It's solid sterling silver and it is stamped. All right guys, so first things first is the flat curb chain. Look, this is one of those chains that has been in the marketplace for a very long time. It's been popular for a very long time and it's one of those chains that is extremely known. A lot of people already have this in their chain collection and perhaps you probably already do. And when it came to gold chains, the flat curb was actually my first chain that I purchased. I purchased an 18 karat gold chain and that was way back many years ago and I actually sold it just for a profit and I kind of regret doing that now. And anyways, like I said, the flat curb is one of those chains that is very popular, very highly sought after and so um, it's one of those OG chains. So one of the things I want to mention guys right off the bat is the eight millimeter. Let's talk about this, this size, this millimeter, because I always like to emphasize this a lot in all of my videos. I want to help you guys as much as I can when it comes to determining how the millimeter actually looks like, because there's a lot of people that are new to jewelry and they don't have a jewelry collection to go base off, right? Because if you already have a chain collection, you can kind of gauge here and there what millimeter will actually look like. If you never owned an eight millimeter, let's say you had a three millimeter, a four and a five, and you want to go maybe, hey, should I jump to an eight? Is that too big, right? Some of you guys have a chain collection that you guys can actually gauge. You guys perhaps have a nine millimeter Cubalink or an eight millimeter or a seven, and you can kind of say, hey, an eight millimeter, it's not a big jump, I can do it, right? But there's a lot of people that don't have that luxury. They, they're they barely starting their jewelry chain collection. And so I want to help you guys when it, when it comes to this eight millimeter, okay? Because again, let's say you jump into an eight millimeter rope chain. Guys, that's an enormous rope chain. Not a lot of people will wear that on a daily. Not a lot of people will wear that even at all, right? Because it, it might be too big. A lot of people purchase the three millimeter rope chains and that's the average, that's the everyday type of millimeter for the masses, right? So I want to just reiterate that when it comes to the eight millimeter flat curves chains, I want you to take a look at this design because it is flat and it doesn't even pop out like the Miami Cubalink chain. The Miami Cubalink chain has more of some meat on it. It kind of pops out a little bit depending on the manufacturer, depending um, who you're buying it from. There's a lot of different ways that the Cubalink chains are made, but the flat curb chain is flat guys, okay? For example, you might purchase the eight millimeter flat curb and you thinking that it's gonna be a big, enormous chain. It, it can be an illusion when it comes to that because it's a flat curb chain. You're gonna notice it when you feel it in your hands. You're gonna get the millimeter. You're, you're gonna get that eight millimeters. You're gonna get that millimeter on the neck and even on the chest, but it's gonna, it's gonna feel different and it's gonna look different, okay? Even if you compare it to something very close looking like a Cubaling chain, okay? Um, the difference is gonna be enormous, um, but I want to just make sure that you guys understand that because I don't want you guys to purchase an eight millimeter curb link and you guys think that it's gonna be some massive chain, some big chain because you see an eight next to it, right? So another thing is check the weight, guys. I put the weights on the website just to give you guys an idea on the price of silver and also most importantly, how many grams you're actually gonna be wearing on the neck. I want you guys to see the grams on the neck if you're if there's something that is 
uh, comfortable for you guys or not. So that's why I have the weights on there. Every batch is different, so there it's an approximate, but at least it gives you an idea. So another thing I wanna talk to you guys about is the shine factor of this chain. The way this chain is cut is nice. It's very simple and it has some very nice shine factor, whether the natural light hits it with the sun or some artificial light if you're in the office or whatever it may be. Okay, the, sh the shine is great. You can kind of see by the B-roll here the way the light reflects on it. And another plus is just for it being silver, as some of you guys know, silver is a very reflective metal, and so it gives it that extra shine as well. So let's talk about the price, okay? When it comes to the flat curb chains, you're gonna get more bang for your buck because you're gonna get a bigger millimeter, but it's also gonna be less weight, right? As you know, less weight, it's gonna be less money. More weight, it's gonna be more money, right? Because it's, it's charged by the design and by the weight. Why would someone get a flat curb chain, okay? And especially, let's just throw in the eight millimeter. Look, it's gonna be based off the size, right? You're gonna get more millimeter. The price, you're gonna pay less. And just because it's an OG chain, this is a very, again, popular chain. It's one of those chains that is sought after and so, I'm pretty sure many of you guys already have a flat curb chain in your jewelry collection. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. If you're still watching, I just want to say a special thanks to all of you guys. If you haven't already, hit the like button. Make sure you do that. It really helps me out when it comes to the YouTube algorithm. And if you have already liked it, please, please, please put a wave emoji in the comments below just letting me know that you like this video. And so thank you so much for watching again, and I'll see you in the next video.